Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my 2021 Christmas house tour. Um, I am so excited to show you guys what I cooked up for this season for Christmas 2021. I just want to preference this video with saying that even though I enjoy decorating my home and adding little seasonal touches, none of that stuff is needed. The season, the reason for the season is to spend time with the people we love and just to enjoy their company and their presence. So you can do that with spending a lot of money. You can do that with spending a little bit of money. So whatever your budget is in whatever space or place you are in your current life, you can make it magical for your family. But without further ado, let's jump right into this video and I hope you guys enjoy my Christmas 2021 house tour and it gives you tons of motivation and inspiration to just add whatever you want to your home. Outside the lighting may be a little bit bright but we have our wreath here that is for Michael's and I added just a few picks in from my Michael's. It was just like a reform and then this Noel sign from Michael's. Um, tons of greenery. That farm fresh sign is for my local grocery store and all of the lanterns are from Amazon. And then some pine cones, those came in a pack from Michael's as well. And then this doormat, it says home for the holidays. And that is from Target. But let's head on in. So guys, we are in my front room. I just have this little um, Bailey's Farm Christmas tree pillow. Um, that cover, it's just a cover and that is from tar um, Amazon. All the other pillows are uh, ones that we have and then this little lantern. For Christmas, I just, on this mirror, I just added this garland from Hobby Lobby, but I love it because it looks super rustic. And then that um, reef I always have up and that's from Hobby Lobby and that bow is from Michael's. And then on top, this is the village that my husband's, mo my husband's mom gave us. Um, it was the one he picked out when he was little. So it is quite old, but it's kind of a tradition and I always include that and put that out. And then another tradition of ours is to, we're gonna go down, to have a little snowball fight and I put the snowballs right there. But everything else on this shelf is just items that we kind of always have there. And that's kind of the little setup of the entryway table. On this side we have our little entryway bench. I have a North Pole special delivery sack and that is from Michael. Some picks here and those are from Hobby Lobby and then our bench is from Tractor Supply I have this from a little shop called Wild Arrows and she made it for my kiddos so we do use that on Christmas Eve I think it's so cute and then inside of our little cage we have a little tree that is from the Target dollar spot a few years back and then our tree that we always have, and I just added a little red lantern there to add a little pop of red. So that's our entryway area. Just, and then over in this area, I just added a little vintage trike, toys, Christmas time. I thought it was fitting. And then I don't have a lot of Ray Dan stuff, but I do have these Ho 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 soup bowls from Ray Dan. I added that in. There's like a little wooden vintage spool in there. And that is from, let's open this up. And that I think I got at like um, Joann's. And then I have a little birch piece here. You can see these little berries. And then a little believe sign on some vintage books down there. So this is the tablescape we did this year. I have that little um, plaid pillow, and that is from Home Goods. And then I just kept it really, really simple. So a few trees. These are from Michael's. 
Um, and then I have some pine cones. Those also came in a bag from Michael's. This um, vintage inspired candle holder, and that is from Hobby Lobby. I seriously got it for like a couple bucks. And then I made just with some leftover greenery, a little centerpiece and threw some berries in there and just kept it really, really simple for our tablescape. That Merry Christmas sign is from um, Dollar, the Target Dollar Spot a few years back. And then for the tablescape, really simple, um, just threw a Christmas tree on there and that came in a pack from um, the, that came in a pack from Hobby Lobby and just some ribbon from Hobby Lobby as well and just kept it sweet and simple. So lots of neutrals, but I added in tons of pops of red just to give it that little extra touch and I love it. And then this is our tree that goes in this area. It's kind of red, white, gold, silver, traditional colors. And we do have the train around the bottom. Um, this sign, I always get questions about it. This is from um, a shop on Instagram. I'll make sure I have it listed down below. They make custom shop um, signs. And that is our last name, Rodriguez. I kept it pretty simple. I have, I added in this garland up here, and that is from um, Party City of all places. And then I just have this tea towel that is from um, Home Goods. And then I just added a little pop of red with that little place um, mat that is from Target. Not place mat, a rug that's from Target. And then I added tea towels over there as well. I have my red Mrs. Myers peppermint um, sent out, and then I also have this little tree that I picked up from my local grocery store. I added in these adorable Santa mugs. Those are from um, Target as well. I think they're so stinking cute. And then just some sprig pieces from Hobby Lobby. And then my trays are from Berry Places. Oh, the cookies for Santa, that is from last year, and that's from Target. And then my trays, the Believe one is from the Target Dollar Spot a few years ago. And the other ones, I believe, are from Home Goods. And then over here, I have a little tea towel from um, um, Target. And then on that pedestal, which is from Hobby Lobby, I added this little tree from Home Goods. I love it, little sparkle. And then that um, Milk for Santa. And we, use, we actually put milk in there for Santa during Christmas, and that is from my local grocery store. So just kept it really simple in the kitchen. Um, we also have the fa la 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 sign, and that is from Hobby Lobby as well. Really simple in the kitchen. Burning, I have this delicious candle. It's called Merry Christmas, and it is from um, it is from Bath and Body Works. And then I have some candy canes. So super simple, super easy, just nice, cozy kitchen area. No, I always like to decorate my daughter's little area. So she has this tiny little tree sitting in the middle that is um, from Michael's, the same tree that's um, sitting on, the two are sitting on my kitchen table. Um, she has this precious tea towel and that is from um, Target Dollar Spot and Sleigh Bells Ring. That little sign is also from Target Dollar Spot. I always like to put a book out. And then back here, she has the countdown to Christmas. She made some gingerbread, and then we have a little elf that was gifted to us. This is like a little kit that we uh, made, and that is from Michael's. Some type of garland, you have all her toys there. But um, this one is from the Target Dollar Spot last year, and I love it, because it just has a little bit of glitter, a little bit of glitz, but it's really cute. And the mantle. So on top I have this huge wreath 
and that is actually from um, Michael's and then I just have a little bow uh, the mirror I always have up there the welcome sign I usually always have up there these um, are from home goods the little um, stocking holders and then these trees are from the Target dollar spot so are the houses the garland is from the Target dollar spot and then the burlap garland behind it that is actually from um, Hobby Lobby and then these are our stocking they are from Personalized Mall. So we have Dad, Mom, my son Dominic, and Brookie. And that is our little mantle area. Here's, you guys know in my house my stairs wrap around, so I have um, garland there from Walmart. It was super affordable. And then I just added in ribbon that I picked up from um, Hobby Lobby and Michaels. So a burlap ribbon, and then this ribbon is super pretty. It looks like it has snow, and then the burlap. So that just wraps around my whole stairs, and the Walmart garland is super affordable. I just kept it super simple. A couple trees from, um, that big one's from Michael, and that one is from the Target Dollar Spot. That candle is from Aldi. This um, hand towel is from Target. And then the peppermint scent soap is actually from um, Trader Joe's. Room area, I kept it super simple. We just have, the rest of the pillows are we usually have on the couch. I just added in this pillow cover. It says Candy Cane Factory. And that was from Amazon. We do have this candle that was from Aldi. I think it's super duper cute. And then these little sprigs, they are from Michaels. And the tin they're in, I always have that. I just chain out, change out the greenery. And that is those little sprigs inside are from Hobby Lobby. And then these little Believe coasters, those are actually from um, Target Dollar Spot a few years back. Her pencil tree over here, love it. The crackling is our fake fireplace, you hear. That reindeer is from Home Goods. We've had them for quite some time. And then um, we have that pillow, and that is from Michael's this year. But that's our little area here. And then we have our fireplace on. And then this little area, I just added in the reindeer and a little tree behind there. So now we are in the kids' room, and for my teenager's room, I just did a six-foot tree here. Underneath, we have a cute snow globe. I just wrapped a little blanket around and then a little Santa pillow. So that is it for him. Um, nothing crazy. from Walmart mostly everything from his tree is from Walmart like I love the topper we have the different tanks and it's just a pre-lit six-foot tree and then some of the ornaments that he made like when he was little we have on there so and then now we're in my daughter's room she's four over here near her vanity, we just, she always has these hooks up, so we just added two little stockings. They are from Target a few years back. And then her tree is right near her bed. It's ombre. It goes from like a darker pink to a lighter pink step back so we can see it and then on her little chair we just have this little pillow it's from the Target dollar spot a few years back as well and then on her dresser we just have this cute little um, Christmas tree and this sign that says let it snow and the sign is a few years back from Target and the Christmas tree is um, this year from Michaels 
and I just thought all the colors and everything go perfect with her room and she's picked out all her ornaments I'll give you up close on some so we have cupcakes we have little reindeer that are blue in color we have some plain white bulbs we have these ones and then of course she doesn't have a lot of homemade ornaments but we have a few on here so another thing and of course we have tons of unicorns so we have this one these are soft and then these ones are really pretty her ornaments and her stuff is either from the trees from Walmart but her ornaments are from Hobby Lobby not Hobby Lobby they are from Walmart or Michaels So that is her little tree. Very cute, pre-lit tree. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, thumbs up, share it, whatever you would like. Um, all of those things really help out my channel. So thank you guys so much, and I will see you very soon with another Christmas fun. Bye, guys. Whoa, oh.